They come with goggles. Okay. Damn. Damn. Who is this for? A child? Hey everyone, thank you so much for tuning in. Okay, so today we are going to be discussing some of my Amazon faves, some of my Amazon favorite products, especially for 2023 because these are some products that I just purchased in this year and I freaking love them. I have to recommend them. I rave about them when people talk about um, or when, they, when I'm talking about home goods or just any type of products like I like they are clutch so if you want to know what are my amazon faves that i recommend for 2023 stay tuned okay so the first thing up is a piece of decor so this is a 60 inch bamboo fan um i actually originally saw this on um, urban outfitters um, and the price for it was like, I think it's like $200 if I'm not mistaken. It's a beautiful large bamboo fan um, that you can use it as a headboard, like decor for headboard, or you could just use it as, as any type of like decor piece for your home. And that's what I decided to do, to put it over top of my television and my living room because that was just such a blank space so i was like let me just put this fan here and i filmed it on amazon i was like once i went on urban outfitters i was like let me see if i could find this on amazon and i did they had them in different sizes and i got the 60 inch from amazon and it was great it came the packaging for it, it actually because it is a fan if they folded it up they wrapped it in shipping packaging and then they like taped it up. So I was like, oh, it didn't come in a box. They shipped it exactly the way it was, just like packaged it up really good. It wasn't damaged or anything. Um, but yeah, I highly, highly recommend checking this fan out. And the reason why I originally didn't purchase it from Urban Outfitters is because I saw some of the, rec like the reviews were saying like there were some discrepancies on the fan because it is bamboo so anything like wicker or bamboo there may be some discoloration or um just like fringes or stuff like that and i was like i'm not paying 200 dollars for this to be you know not evenly i, I understand like how it's is not going to be like all wooden tables it's not going to be the same um, wood pattern things like that it might not be the same pattern as the one displayed but I just was like I'm not paying $200 for that so I found it on Amazon and I highly recommend it if you're interested in purchasing a bamboo fan even if you want a small one I highly recommend purchasing this bamboo fan the next thing is um, a lot of this stuff is home stuff so the next thing is my Roku stick so I originally had have a Roku stick connected to my television. Um, but I recently purchased something else, which we'll talk about. Um, and I didn't feel like keep taking out my Roku stick from the living room and then going in my bedroom. Like, I didn't feel like keep doing that. So I purchased a Roku stick, which is actually on sale right now. So if you want to purchase one now, what the Roku stick looks like. I don't know if you can see that. It's a little stick. It has an adapter here. You plug it in and then you just plug it into the wall, your outlet. Um, so this is the only thing that you'll uh, plug up to either your television. If you have some type of other device you want to plug it up to. It has everything from um, any type of streaming app that you have you can add it on there um i'll also try to include some pictures of how it looks on my television um so you can kind of see what it looks like but i highly highly recommend um the roku stick it's a good price like i said right now it's on sale i think i got it for like 40 dollars. the next purchase is an addition that the reason why i had to purchase the roku stick is because i actually 
purchase a projector. So I do not have a television in my bedroom for years. I didn't um, have a television here. But one day I was like, I don't want a TV, but I do want to have like some type of entertainment other than my laptop or my tablet. And I actually found a really good projector on Prime Day. So Prime Day is something uh, that Amazon holds every year where they have heavily discounted products on their site and it's for like 24 hours I believe but this is my projector um you can see that here let's see now this isn't like a name brand projector um and this is a, this was my way of testing out projectors I was like let me see if I can I got this I saw the reviews on this it was great so I purchased it um as you can see here this is where I would put my Roku stick there so bam I just put it in there and then plug up to the wall it comes with just a you know regular outlet adapter um there it also came with like a wipe as well um and it also comes with a remote now this does not come with a speaker um so luckily i already had an alexa mini in my bedroom so i just hooked that up to the the projector and it works out fine i highly 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 recommend purchasing this projector like i said i looked at the reviews the reviews were very good and because of that i was like let me try it if i don't like it i'll just return it and then i'll do my research to find a like a much more expensive not just expensive but like something that kind of holds weight um because some of these projectors are very expensive i got this for a really great price i think it was under 60 bucks usually projectors can range from anywhere to like a couple of hundred dollars to like 300 plus it also came with a screen like a faux screen that you can like tape to your wall i don't use that because i do have a blank wall in my um bedroom i have nothing on the wall so i basically use the wall as my screen and when i tell you it works out great i'm going to insert clips of like photos and then also pictures video footage of like what it looks like in my bedroom i also um don't have like a shelf so because my headboard is extremely high, I just sit it on top of my headboard and it works out fine for me. But yeah, this is something that I definitely recommend. Like if you have a shelf or some type of stand you can put this on, you will need to put it on so that you can get it angled in a great way. Because you don't want it to be like very low. You want it to be higher above or centered um, in eye vision. So that you can like have a good experience when you're watching stuff but yeah it really looks like a theater it goes from i think mine is on 50 inch inches i think it goes up to like 80 inches if i'm not mistaken or 100 or something like that i have to look at the notes but i just keep it on 50 50 is large enough for me i think my television in my living room is like a 30 inch like i'm not someone as like huge on televisions and stuff like that um i just like to have like a good experience so as long as it looks good i'm fine it doesn't have to be super huge but in my bedroom it's like 50 inches and it looks great um also like i said this is the remote too that comes with the roku and this is the remote that comes with the projector so you know that and it's voice activated too for the Roku. This is my uh, mini Alexa. So I use this as my speaker so that I can hear everything on the projector. Um, and it works perfect for me. Like if I wanted to take my other speaker from my living room to do that, I can. But this is much smaller and it fits on my nightstand. And it just, it works well. I can hear everything well. So yeah. I actually got this because I had 
it, it was an offer where if you got a free trial of, I think it was like Amazon Music, you would get this for like a dollar or something like that. And I was like, let me get this. And I got this a while ago. So I got this and it really came in handy. Um, so I do like to use this for also um, my podcast in my bedroom. I like to use this for audiobooks as no, well. Yes, sir. No man. And guess what they wanted anyway? That they outwitted this civilization to the extent. Yeah, this is a really great one. Okay, hey y'all, I'm checking in from the future. So there was one last Amazon, well actually two Amazon things that I forgot to talk about. So um, I purchased some really cute Bible tabs. But as you can see, like have like the tabs and I like these tabs because they are earth tone so I have like different tabs you can see Esther, Job, Psalms, Proverbs I really like these tabs because of the color of course um, Amazon has like a bunch of different ones like if you want to do like bolder colors or flowers and stuff like that they even have like leather tabs as well but i did like these the most for me um so i will link that down below as well and also the last thing i did show kind of showcase this i did showcase um my projector but also one another addition to that is my lights so i have colored lights Excuse my place I do need to clean up but I have colored lights um so they change different colors green blue orange aqua another orange a pink a purple a pink um and then they have like yellow so and then it can you can do where you kind of like does like a little color montage if you want so i really like this especially when i have my theater set up and i'm like watching my projector i think it's really cool so i will link this below as well so you can see this is the remote that it comes with all right um so that's all i wanted to share from the future all right back to the video. okay next up is my record player stand so i purchased this um recently because i was i received a record player and a speaker for my birthday this year and i did not have a record player stand so i was like let me see if i could find something i looked everywhere i actually looked at target i looked at other um stores that i love um and i didn't see anything that grabbed my attention um and the prices were kind of crazy so i was like let me see what's on amazon and i actually found this record player stand and it is great it actually has a light attached to it as well so if you want to add color um like if it's a you're playing something at night you want to add color to it you can do that um it has slots for actual records you can take those slots out as well but i like to leave them in um and yeah it holds my record player it has a section for my speaker and then it also in the back of the stand it has like a little hole so you can like have all of your wires go out and it's just like easily coordinated so you don't have wires everywhere it's not hard to kind of like um plug everything up so I, I really 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 highly recommend that um like i said i got my record player and my speakers for my birthday they are actually on amazon as well um the people that purchased this for me did not purchase this off of amazon but i will link them 
um, in the description bar box as well because they're inside of this video that clip that I'll show you just in case if you're interested in purchasing. So my record player is Audio Technica and then um, it's a really, really great record player. I highly recommend it. Um, I think it's on sale too on Amazon if I'm not mistaken. And then my speakers are um, Marshall Acton. That is the, the speaker. I think a lot of people get the Stanmore, if I'm not mistaken. The Stanmore is kind of larger, but the Acton is a bit smaller. But when I tell you, great, great, great coverage. Like, you can hear everything. Every every cymbal, every drum, every bass. Like, you can hear everything. It is also Bluetooth, so if you want to hook up your cell phone to it, you can do that as well. Now, the thing about the Acton is that I actually had to purchase another piece, which I found on Amazon. And because of this, I was able to save hundreds of dollars. Um, well, the person that purchased this for me, they were able to save, save hundreds of dollars because I purchased the Acton Marshall instead of the Stanmore. And yeah, it really helped. So I purchased this. I think this is a 3.5 millimeter um, female to male adapter. And the thing is, the actual Anton, they have the red and the white uh, mel forms. No, excuse me. Sorry, sorry. The rec My record player has uh, the mel red and white plugs, but the Acton only has the the female adapter so I needed to get something where I can connect my actual record player to the actual Edson and I'll insert a clip of it how that looks now I purchased this this was very affordable and I also like it because if you can see here this the actual wire is very thick so I do have like a very small slot where I have to put the actual speaker in and this does have to kind of bend, so this is not going to like wither away. It's not like one of those cords that is going to be easily damaged, like if it was like a plastic uh, wire or anything like that. So I like that because I do have to insert that. So yeah, I highly recommend if you want to save a couple of hundred dollars on getting the Acton Marshall speaker versus the Stanmore, then I highly recommend purchasing this. Next thing up is gold nails okay so this is what i use to hang um the bamboo fan and i'm also starting a gallery wall in my bedroom i got some really cool masks from new orleans when i went to go visit and i wanted to put those up and i have some other pictures that i want to get uh, matte and framed so I'm trying to like get that together and I'm working on a puzzle too that I want to get framed as well so I needed very large nails for some of those masks and if you can see here this is like the largest nail that they have in the box um, and I really needed this so that I can uh, post up that masks they have smaller ones i think this is the size that i use for the bamboo and then they have just like really small nails but i wanted it because it was gold and if you i don't know i just i'm very particular about stuff like that but yeah this is the gold if you want some really cool gold nails for any type of home decor project i highly recommend this this was really this came clutch for me this year okay so i purchased a drill because okay so y'all know i purchased a record player stand and the record player stand was not hard to put together it was it was easy to put together but it is from amazon it is a good stand but i do need to drill some of the nails because they weren't fully fitting in um so i did purchase 
this drill kit. This is the drill kit. You can see here. They come with goggles. Okay. Damn. Damn. Who is this for? A child? These goggles are kind of small. They come with the goggles. And then we got the drill. Okay, because we're about to start drilling. Okay. So yeah, it comes with um this drill. It's gonna be the thumbnail. <laughs> anyway, it comes with um of course the drill adapter to so plug it in. And then we have like different bolts that we can use to drill everything in. I'll just hold it up so you can see. So you can see there. Um yeah like um I highly recommend this. Um this is very helpful for me because I'm not really a tech savvy girl when it comes to like doing projects but I want to make sure I get stuff done. I don't want to have like chips and you know like i don't i want it to be as neat as possible now i still have to rehang some of my photos like i have to fix that up but for the most part my everything is pretty neat and organized so i try to keep it as good as possible but yeah i highly recommend um purchasing a drill if you need any type of like home improvement uh, DIY projects that you need. This is a really good drill. And it's cute, you know? It's cute. These glasses is cute. Like, they're not even sunglasses, but they're they're drill glasses. Like, I'm gonna go... Like, these are cute. I can wear these. Like, they're so cute. So next up is my shoe stretcher. Now listen, girl my shoe stretcher um sometimes now i used to go to the cobbler to like stretch my shoes and i'm just like why i'm not doing it anymore when i can just buy a shoe stretcher um so this is actually a really good shoe stretcher and I, i've used it and it worked really well i had some really great brother bellies shoes that i needed to kind of stretch a little bit because they they fit but they were like I don't want any corns or anything on my feet. So, especially if you have like dainty sandals where the strap is, you know, you know, crossing your pinky toe or like just like your big toe, you want to make sure you're, it's not rubbing and chafing on there and you get, you know, discrepant like injuries on your feet. So, this is a really great shoe stretcher. It came with these little props as well so that if you want to like make sh add like a little bit of extra stretch by the toe yeah. but I highly 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 recommend this um, shoe stretcher it's a phone charger okay so this is a pack I think it was like a pack of five or six phone chargers and they come in multiple colors. They were like pastel colors. I have a pink one, a purple one, and like blue ones and uh, green ones. But the smaller ones, they have like smaller ones. I use that for my work, prints of work and my car. And then this one, as you as you can see, like look, this is, I have my AirPods. Look how long this is. So if I'm in the bed and I just want to charge my phone and it's not that flimsy cord that no shade that apple gives you this actually is going to last a long time so i highly highly recommend if you want to charge it as longer you want to be in your bed or you you're you have a charger outlet that's far away and you need a longer charger get this you got i got a pack of like six for a really great price okay let's keep it going for a travel so i recently went to new orleans and it was hot as hell y'all so i when i watched a lot of videos of like tips they all said buy a mini fan and when i tell you this was the best thing i could have did um so it has three prompts 
feels great. But I highly recommend if you're traveling to a warmer location or if you're going to a concert or something like that, highly recommend. This came in a pack of two. This is not battery operated. You just charge it. Um, so you charge it and then go, go, on, go on your merry way. Going back to chargers, I have a portable charger. So just to kind of show you. This is a portable charger. This is my phone. And you can see here, I just take the charger, put it on my phone. Here is charging my phone. I don't know if you can see. Yeah, it's charging my phone. There. And then you can see here is at 100%. I don't know if y'all can see that. But yeah, so portable charger, recommend this as well. Um, if you're going to like, traveling or you going to a concert especially if you're going to a concert or some type of event and you want to make sure you have a charger you might not have access to an outlet you get a portable charger i highly recommend it. this i will link it down below this is another thing that i love like this is um a phone case like i freaking love this and i'll put it on um i took it off so that you all can see what it looks like but it has like the little tray so that you can have your charm there and then i can just it's like a silicone case but this is sorry my light but this is my phone case mirror chrome heart cartoon very animated i love this freaking phone case but i got this off of amazon and it comes in clutch i like this when i'm going to like different events because like i could just have it on my wrist and then like kind of move around really instead of just having my phone in my bag or something it's just like right there if i need it so i highly recommend that oh resistant bands okay so this is like the little fitness section so i i'm recently going through some fitness um, like my fitness journey because I have some things that I have to work on I've been gaining um, some weight and it's because of like health issues um, that is out of my control I don't even eat a lot but it's just like I have to drastically change my diet um, I recently purchased a Peloton and I, I'm changing my diet like I have to cut out caffeine dairy all this stuff and I'm also I'm going to talk about this more, but I'm also getting surgery soon, and I'm looking forward to that because it is, like, this particular thing is, like, affecting my body to the point where, like, I have to go to physical therapy. So, anyway, um, resistant bands. I purchased a door anchor. So, this is what the door anchor looks like. This is wrapped up, and I'll show you also what it looks like on the door. And then I have different resistant bands. I love this because they're like pastel colors, right? And I have a purple one here, so pastel colors. Um, super cute. Um, they go from like 25 pounds. Got 25 pounds. 15. 10. Oops. 10. And I think it says for 5. Oh, this is 30 pounds. Um, yeah, I think it's like a 10 or 5. But yeah, these are the resistant bands. I use this with the door anchor to do like different workouts. Um, and I highly, highly recommend um, purchasing this. The door anchor is very strong. Um, these resistance bands, I like to double them up. And they're really, really good. So I highly recommend if you want to get some fitness stuff. I highly recommend that I use these. They actually work really well. It also came with, it comes in like these little dust bags. You put the door anchor inside of here. Like it is just, it fits easily inside of there, which is cool. So when you're like storing, just put it up. That's it. So the last one, we're still on fitness. Now, so I told y'all I purchased a Peloton. 
I have the actual Peloton shoes, but I want to also go to classes and I just think it's kind of tacky to go to a class with the Peloton shoes. So I decided to purchase a pair of shoes that I can take and go to a class. I purchased these Nikes. They were on sale. They had a back to school sale. They had a they were on sale, and then I had, they had a back to school coupon. So I got these for dirt cheap. These sneakers usually run a hundred and some dollars. I think that I got these for like fifty dollars. So what I got from Amazon was the actual Delta cleat. So this is what Nike. provide you with but this is not the cleat that you can use on a peloton and some other like bikes that have a spin class you're typically going to use the delta cleat so i had to purchase the delta cleat um and it worked out good where it fits perfectly inside of my peloton i just installed it myself it's very easy it's not hard to do you just screw you just link it up, screw it in, and then you can see there. So I haven't worn these yet because I haven't gone to a public class yet. I've been just using my Peloton. But yeah, I'm excited to use these. But I highly recommend if you purchase any sneakers, um, any cycling sneakers, and you need a three-prop Delta cleat, get the Delta style cleat off of Amazon for dirt cheap. I think I paid $7 for them, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, and last thing, last but not least, um, this. This looks like a regular composition book, but it is not. It is my iPad cover. So it's my case for my iPad. So I love this. Um, it's cute. A lot of people, every time I pull this out, they're like, oh, that's a notebook. And then when I pull it out and then I start like writing um, on my iPad, they're like, that is so cool. But yeah, I freaking love this. I actually had this. I think I purchased this last year. Um, but yeah, I highly recommend if you want a cool iPad cover. That's cute. It's very durable. Um, yeah, I freaking love it. It's affordable. Great. But yeah, these are all things that I highly, 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 highly recommend. I've been using them. I've been loving them this year um, and some even last year. But yeah. Yeah, but those are my Amazon favorites. Please let me know if you purchase any of these items or if you have some Amazon favorites. Um, yeah, I want to know because like um, it's just like. It's very convenient. So, yeah, please like, comment, and subscribe. Um, thank you so much for tuning in. I will catch you on another one. Peace.